First thing in the morning, make some coffee. <laughs> Watching a video on YouTube is really only a highlight reel of what people want you to see. But to really get to know somebody, you've got to spend the day with them. After getting the coffee going, the first thing I do in the morning is check my Instagram, is check my social media. It's, no, <laughs> that's not what I do first thing. That's a terrible thing to do first thing in the morning. What do I do? I open up the Bible and I start reading. And when my coffee comes, oh, it's just a perfect combination. Good morning. Good morning, Sarah Chen. Well, first one up. As the day starts, the kids start coming out one by one, looking for a good spot to hunker down and start the day. The Kotatsu table is a favorite spot. The Mama Chan's all comfortable, and Sarah all comfortable in her spot. <laughs> Whoa, dude. Good morning. Big hug. Oh, we're just crashing to me. <laughs> Joshua is the snuggle bug of the family, and we love our morning hugs and kisses from this guy. Here go the not so littles. Ready for their Bible time. Is that in Japanese? Yeah, the ad, the ad. Oh, the ad was. Because it's on YouTube. Oh, I see. Everything moves towards 7 a.m. when we get together as a family for breakfast. But before breakfast arrives, there's some time to finish up chores and make some calls with loved ones on the other side of the world. Can you carry it all at once? Yeah. Don't drop, drop it. it. Mommy just folded it so nicely. Today we're getting ready for something super special. Visitors we haven't had in nearly four years. Hello. Hello. Are you all packed? Yeah, I just finished. Stuff at other places or throw some stuff out. Good morning, Anna. <laughs> oh, that was a video. <laughs> That's what she was like. <laughs> On most weekdays, breakfast happens at 7 in the morning, and we do our family devotions, have breakfast together, and then go get going for the day. Everybody, hold your hand. Joshua. <laughs> Amen. Too many sons. Once the day starts, everyone will be off in their own direction with their own responsibilities to take care of. But here at breakfast, we have a chance to be together as a family, something we highly value. We have Sarah. Joshua and the twins. What about the twins here? When they get back from school, they need to put the backpack in the white place and then throw away a mask, change your clothes, put the hachi in the uh, sink. sink, and do your homework. And you need to clean the room and put away clothes. What's what's this down here? Down. Room sink. No. <laughs> Bathroom sink. Oh. <laughs> and then super dishes. Super dishes. Oh, I see. Okay. Super dishes. <laughs> Some super dishes. Sarah, what's your special chores? Uh, clean room and quarters. Oh, Joshua, how about you, dude? Put away the shoes. Put away and organize the shoes. We need to wake up. All right, you guys need to finish eating. Oh, the last piece goes in. Oh. And you did it for the camera. Everybody's so happy. You're making your uniform look spick and span, huh? <laughs> you get all the little fuzzies off of it, Becca? I can go to the bathroom. You can go to the bathroom? Yes. Joshua! Where's your knuckle, honey? It's not there. I have to write his temperature, check his homework, check his reading, get out all the papers. <laughs> And I was about to practice, but it's go time, huh? Go time. <laughs> what the world? This does not look like go time, guys. And mamas are ready for her walk. Mom's gonna see me doing English at school and see how easy it is. <laughs> Good. I hope you don't mess up. I never they mess ask up. You, uh -huh. Big test sometimes I do. I know it by myself. Oh, okay. Mommy, did you buy a sad fact of life in Japan? My feet are too big. 
That's my men's shoes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I think what the saddest thing is, is it's just a half a size too big for the ladies' shoes. Oh, that's sad. I had to find some, but I went to three stores. No. Yeah, three four? stores. Oh. Joshua, wait. Ready, Josh? Okay, who are you, Josh? You're blessed to be a blessing. Yeah. Sarah, we've come up with these declarations. They all come from the Bible and they're truths about who we are. And so we have the kids say them before they leave just to remember who they are. Blessed to be a blessing. <gasps> yes. Awesome. I love you guys. Have a blessed day today. We've got some really ominous clouds today. Warm, windy, spring weather. Bye, guys. Bye, Bye girls. Once the kids are off to school, then it's my turn to get going to work. But today, since I was filming everybody, I didn't have a chance to get ready and shower myself. So I'm going to do that now and then get to work. So the girlfriend's back from the walk. How did it go? All right, I'm heading to work. So that means I got to give Ruth a little kiss here. I love you. A study has been done. It's, uh, this is a real study that men who kiss their wives before going to work live on average five years longer than the men who don't. How about that? Now, I don't believe that it's just because kissing adds five years on average to your life. I believe it's because these husbands had a relationship with their wives that they wanted to kiss them every morning, that they prioritized their wives and they prioritized that relationship and it created a good atmosphere in which that they lived all the days of their life. I run a small home office where I can focus on my work. And while I check things off my to-do list, Ruth is busy doing the same thing back at home. Okay, so I just did a little bit of cleaning. Now I have some bills to pay, so I'm gonna run to the post office and pay some of those. I love my job and all the different aspects of what I get to do. There's such a variety to it, and it keeps moving forward, just like life. Look at my hair. It's so windy and rainy. I'm glad I'm walking into pay bills. But you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm glad to be home now. <laughs> <laughs> Spring rain. Hey, that's all right. Brings the flowers. Over lunchtime, I usually do my dual lingo, my Japanese study. I've been doing this now for I think I have a 980 some day streak going on. It's, it's pretty good. So now I can go to the girls school because it's class observation for the twins. So. Clouds really got epic. It stopped raining. And look over here. The kids are being released from school. They'll be back soon. One thing I love about this school being so close is you can watch them walk home the whole way. Hey guys, welcome home. So, how uh, was school today, guys? Good? Good. Anything awesome happen? No. Just a normal day at school. Mom! What's happening tomorrow? Grandma and Grandpa. Grandma and Grandpa! Daddy, I'm hungry. You're hungry? Give some chocolate pretzels. We can have something else. I know it. <laughs> oh, oh, that's a good thought. We can eat the Pokemon thing. Yeah! So you guys have to practice your piano lesson today, huh? Uh, You're about to have that here in just a little bit. How about homework? Did you get some homework? Yes. Yes. That will have to be done too, huh? It's Pikachu. Uh-huh. Photo, blah, blah, blah. How, how was school today? Good. Good? <laughs> Anything special happened today? Not really. Uh, and all while drinking a drink. <laughs> so. <laughs> yes. Wow, well, mommy came. Well, now that that's special. <laughs> Did you do it all right? Yeah. All right, I grabbed a black coffee and a carbonated water, and now it's back to work for a few hours. 
Got to get these videos done and keep everything else moving forward. While the kids do their homework and piano lessons, I get more work done before heading back home for the evening. Okay, so once we get home, we usually have dinner together. Tonight is a little different because the girls have juku, there were piano lessons and everything, but we have a special family time of praise and worship and it's really fun. We do the dances, does marvels for changing the atmosphere in our home. After all the responsibilities are done, free time can be enjoyed a number of ways. Sierra, are you getting your turn on the switch? Yeah. How many minutes you get? 30. 30 minutes. Here it goes. All right, today things are busy. I'm gonna run out for my jog here real quick. And the girls have their phone at 1%. <laughs> the girls are heading to their juku. Here we go. Getting out and jogging again. Today it feels nice. Doesn't always feel nice every day, but it's a good thing. Whew. Today I reached the bridge, which was my goal. And then I'm gonna run back. Just taking a quick little breather here. The not so little, little writers have taken their baths, right? And what do you got there? No. Whoa, a master sword. Nice. And Sierra, what time is it right now? Dancing. Berenstein Bear time! We're gonna read some Berenstein Bears! Come. Daddy just needs to sit in the middle. Look up. Computer trouble. Computer trouble or... Oh, let's do Save Them Sound. Does this sound good? Berenstein Bear voice coming up. Here we go. One Saturday afternoon, brother and sister bear took off down the driveway on their skateboards. Okay, we're done with our Berenstein Bears and that can only mean one thing. No. Ah, Joshua no. knows. Joshua knows. You can't do your homework, dude. No. You didn't do your homework, Mister. I love homework. It's my hobby. Huh. What's your favorite hobby? Me. Yeah, you. Me. Um, homework. Doing homework. Well, I'll remember that one later. Yeah. <laughs> How about you go do your hobby? Huh? I'll do mine. Kick away, kids! <laughs> well, the girls are in Juku. So I'm trying to just wash up some dishes. We have some friends coming over for dinner. I fed half the crew. Now I get to feed my friends. Oh, so we have our friends. Seth and Jess are over here enjoying dinner. Oh, they're back. So, girls. We made it to the end of the day. Now what do you want to do to chillax a little bit? Any ideas? No video. No video? Oh. I don't watch a movie or something like that. I don't watch a movie or something. All right, that sounds great. So but listen to this. I went to their school and, you know, they always come home and they're like, oh, blah, blah, blah. Dude, their friends were just blabbing away with these girls. They were laughing, having the time of life. Is this true? <laughs> True. All right, let's watch something and chillax here. We made it to the end of the night. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Kachik. Ah, I got no more recording. This is us chilling. Look, you're chilling. Don't you want to see this later and be like, hey, that was us chilling. <laughs> Why stop now? Just click the thumbnail for another great episode of Life in Japan. <laughs>